Good evening, everyone. How, how is everyone doing? That's a bit right. <clears throat> when my dad's looking for the remote, he has his first initial look round, and if it's not in reaching distance, it'll just sit there, <laughs> slowly getting wound up the telly. <laughs> Why you brought that? It's a piece of shit. <laughs> But only go for 25 quid. <laughs> <laughs> I've got better shit up my arse. <laughs> 280 quid, you're having a laugh. <laughs> what are you going to use that for? Just, you know, door stopping, fucking paperweights. <laughs> Who uses paperweights? Nobody uses paperweights. The only time I need a paperweight is to smash someone over the end of the street somebody a fucking paperweight. <laughs> it's just facing your boiler. He must fetch the remote. <laughs> <laughs> oh, by the way, um, in my household, we call the remote a doofer. <laughs> and I thought this was the proper name for it, but... Um, <laughs> does anyone else have weird names they call their TV remotes? Yep. Yeah. Uh, I mean... <laughs> a flicker. Put your hand up. A flicker. I don't think that's a remote. <laughs> I went to my mate's house and I went, pass me a doofer, mate. He goes, what? I said, the doofer. I said, what is the doofer? I said, it's the remote control for Teddy. He said, no, it ain't, mate. That's the hurdy gurdy. The hurdy gurdy. Now, Benji's nickname remained Benji. However, my nickname got changed to doofer. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like someone's calling you an idiot. Doofer. <laughs> or what you would call a failed aeroplane. That's a doofer, that one. <laughs> or what you would call the smell of burnt food. I can smell doofer everywhere. <laughs> and this nickname never got changed to Hurdy Gurdy. <laughs> Which is fucking hilarious for a nickname. <laughs> <laughs> you going out tonight? Oh yeah, yeah. Who are you going with? <laughs> Hurdy Gurdy's coming. <laughs> Town is gonna be a riot. <laughs> Hurdy Gurdy, get me a pint. <laughs> See, I can wait for Hurdy Gurdy. <laughs> 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 Gurdy's late. I don't mind because when he arrives, I get to call him Hurdy Gurdy. <laughs> we had a mate actually. We called him Jingle. His first name was James. His surname was Ingle. So we just <laughs> Jingle. <laughs> Genius. But no, Benji. It shall remain. Now, when my dad um, can't find the doofer, God help us. He turns the whole room upside down. And you all do it, you all start in the centre of the room, scanning the area. <laughs> <laughs> if you can't find it by then, you go to the first spot, which is down the side of the sofa, where you were sat. <laughs> nice logic, I like it. You go down to the greasy side of the sofa with years worth of crumbs and nails. <laughs> oh, come on, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> and burgies. And as soon as you stop searching a spot, a seed is planted in your head. You didn't search hard enough. <laughs> and it grows every time you fail to find it. So you have to go back and oh 20p. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> every little helps. <laughs> Fucking hell. 
Pissing bastard thing. Fuck's sake. Ugh. He'll get up and start chucking cushions in fury. Fucking doofer, how do you lose a bloody doofer? Sat with your friends around, fucking morons. In this house. Oh. What's this? Look what I found out. <laughs> you fucking little shit. <laughs> no bed. <laughs> oh, sorry, Dad, I didn't know you wanted it. Fuck <laughs> off, will you? <laughs> that works every time. <laughs> Smudged. <laughs> well, at least I can rely on my right hand when I need it. <laughs> that was a joke about masturbation. <laughs> <laughs> no, I love my nan. I love my nan. She's brilliant as well. She's beautiful. I love her. She's 84. And in her mind, she still thinks she's 16, bless her. I mean, she's got dementia. <laughs> dementia homes a few years ago. So I looked everyone to see it. It's brilliant. They all steal each other's things. And it's the perfect crime. Because people can't remember who did it. And the person committing the crime can't remember doing it either. So my man has got five toothbrushes and the teeth. I love it. Sometimes I go and turn my guitar down Sing them a few songs, they love it, and it's a gig for me. But they got <laughs> But they pay me in statues of frogs. <laughs> and like, they've all got different personalities, I mean, so are the residents. <laughs> but the frogs have got different personalities. So there's one where it's like, Big, bright lipstick. There's one frog that's dressed as a farmer, carrying a wheelbarrow. There's always a wheelbarrow. There's one, one statue of two frogs, arm in arm like this. Dressed as Laurel and Hardy. Now some of them are leaning towards being a bit racist. Like there's this, all right. There's this one frog, and it's a bent over, carrying all this stuff. In a, in a bag that's made of flowers, which is really cool. And you should sit behind it. And you can get out all the tools, and it's like, there's a hammer, which is, uh, the head is stone, and the handle's grass, which I don't think would work, because it'd be a bit floppy <laughs> every time you use it. <laughs> get your heads on the go, guys. <laughs> there's a flask that's made out of leaves, you know, they have to stay hydrated, forward thinking, I like it. <coughs> but this, the other frog, this other, his buddy, which is a lighter, greener colour, by the way, he's just walking along, whistling, like that kind of cartoon whistle, which makes the lips really long. I've never seen anyone do it before, but... <laughs> I hang my keys on him. He's doing fuck all. It's buddy, it's carrying all the shit. Does it look heavy? Yes, it does. <laughs> I think the care is going by all these lovely ornaments to make the place feel nice and homely, nice and comfortable. But the residents don't like them, so just give them to me. <laughs> and so this some guy doing a car boot sale every week in Staxonbury goes home to his wife's like, we sold out again, love. We'll be able to open a little shop soon. Call it Frog Leap. <laughs> oh, loads in the UK, loads of Frog Leaps in the UK. We'll make millions. Be rich. And I'll show Jeff down at the market that he's in the wrong business. <laughs> <laughs> Selling sunglasses. Pfft, what a loser. Statues of Frogs is the future, guys. You heard it here first. <laughs> but no, 
I'd, I'd go down and I'd, I'd take my guitar, and experience is experience, which is what my manager says I need. <laughs> experience. <laughs> And so I'm going to play you their most requested song. <laughs> Which they always forget after I've played it. <laughs> Sometimes it's the only song I play two hours set. Right, it's the only song I can play. I'm like, kick me when I'm down. I hope you enjoy. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. All the king's horses and all the king's men couldn't put Humpty together again. Why he jumped, nobody knows. His wife just left him, which made him low. The cracks are all the beginning to show, but nobody gave a fuck. The exact reason. Exact reason. Because Humpty's an egg. Catch up, guys. Come on. You with me? Yeah. Yeah. Exactly, the exact reason why he died. He couldn't pay his taxes on time, which scrambled his brains and fried his mind. It's not funny to yoke about suicide. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes, we rhymes are fun. Sweeping all the words, then please sing along. Don't be afraid to join in. Even if you can't sing, I'm sure you'll be alright. These are Ryan's favourites. Nursery rhymes, what's the matter? You all seem quiet. I don't know the words, but I'm an idiot. Well, it could be far, far, far worse. But not as bad as this next verse. <laughs> Jack and Jill went for the hills and fetch a pail of water. Jack fell down and broke his crown, so Jill came tumbling after. So Jill's a cunt and Jack can't get up. I think that Jill is shooting, she's a useless bitch, and Jack should wish much better friends than he's been given. But there's <laughs> sexual tension. <laughs> Jack would love to shove his dick in her arms with all kinds of things. Jack would have been a raper who passed his ball to the good office. Nigga and brown paper. Let's be right, have fun. So we know the words, then please. Say it all. Say it Be all right, these are Ryan's favourites. Nursery rhymes, what's the matter? You're all still quiet. <laughs> Though you did try hard, it was a poor effort. But don't you worry, this is me ending my set. Goodbye from me, I hope that nobody here got upset. Thank you. <laughs>